Hey, welcome to the show. Today on the show, we are going to learn how to tell time to the nearest hour and half hour. All right, stay tuned. Hey, welcome back to the show. Today on the show, we're going to learn how to tell time to the nearest hour and half hour. When we look at a clock, we see two hands, don't we? We see this big hand here and a smaller hand, a shorter hand. This hand right here is called the minute hand, and this hand right here is called the hour hand. When we tell time to the nearest hour, I take a look at the big hand, and if it's pointing to the top, it's something to clock. So you can see right now it's pointing to the top, isn't it? And so what we need to do then is look at the hour hand and look to see what number it's pointing at. And it's pointing toward the seven, isn't it? So then we would say seven o'clock. So once again, if the big hand is pointing to the top, it's something o'clock. So when we read the time to the nearest half hour, that big hand is gonna go all the way down here. And what I like to say is when the big hand is pointing down, it's something 30, all right? So right now, it's something 30, isn't it? And so we take a look at the hour hand, which is in the land of the seven, between the seven and the eight, that belongs to the seven. So it's 730. So let's go ahead and try another number. All right. What time is it? It's something o'clock, right? The big hand is pointing to the top, so it's something o'clock. And then we look at the hour hand, so it's four o'clock. All right, the minute hand is pointing down, so it's something 30. So it is four thirty. Oh, you guys are getting really good. Let me see if I can give you another one here. Where's the minute hand? It's pointing down, isn't it? So it's something 30. So take a look at the hour hand. It is 8.30. Oh, you're really good. Oh, let's see if you can see what this one is. Which time is it here? The big hand is pointing to the top, so it's something o'clock. So it is 9 o'clock. We looked at the hour hand. It's pointing to the 9. It's 9 o'clock. Boy, you are math ninjas today, aren't you? Can you tell me what time it is here? Look at the minute hand. Is it pointing to the top or to the bottom? It's pointing to the bottom, isn't it? So it's something 30. So it's 10, 30. All right, I'm gonna give you a tricky one here. Are you ready for a tricky one? What is this one? Take a look at the minute hand first. So it's something 30, isn't it? And then the hour hand is in the land of the six, right in here. So it's 630. Oh, you really are very good today. All right, I'm going to give you another tricky one. What if both hands are pointing to the top? Well, once again, the minute hand is pointing to the top, so it's something o'clock. And then we take a look at the hour hand, which is 12, so it's 12 o'clock. Let's do one more. What time is it here? You're right, the big hand is pointing down, so it's something 30. So we look right here at the hour hand, which is 2.30. So today we learned how to tell time to the nearest hour and half hour. If we look at the minute hand, remember, if it's pointing up, it's something o'clock. And if it's pointing down, it's something 30. All right. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show today. Make sure you check out my other videos and have a very fun day. Adios.